Hey, what's up, guys? Been a while. Uh, I'm still moving, still in, in the transitional phase. That's why I haven't been putting up any videos. Um, but it's getting close. Still haven't set up the studio either. Just rehabbing the house I bought. Uh, anyway, I've got some exciting stuff for you. Uh, if you've been watching me for a while, uh, you probably know that one of my more popular videos is the stereo widening without VST plugins video. Um, I guess stereo, uh, white stereo imaging is important for a lot of producers, and rightfully so. Um, but I got some really exciting news. Um, basically, in my video, uh, and I'll leave the link below in the description box in case you've never seen it, um, I show you uh, the, the quickest way I know how to uh, spread out a stereo image without using plugins. And uh, essentially, I'm using the Haas effect, the H A A S effect, very well known pretty standard effect. Uh, but uh, a couple days ago, I got, um, I got a comment from, uh, from a viewer and a subscriber by the name of Ben Althauser. And I hope I'm saying that name right, Ben, if you're watching this. Ben Althauser. Anyways, it turns out that Ben is an audio software engineer. So not, a, not necessarily a mixing engineer, although he might be, but he actually writes plugins. He's an, uh, an audio software engineer. And what Ben did was um, he saw my tutorial on how to do the Haas effect and how to widen out um, without a plug-in. And, and if you watch the video, one of the things I complain a lot about is when you, when you get a stereo widening plug-in, a VST typically, I find that it washes out the sound. And why I like the Haas effect is that it doesn't. It just shifts uh, the wave files, uh, delays them ever so slightly. Anyway, watch the video to get the details. Uh, the exciting part is Ben actually uh, modeled what I said in that tutorial into a plugin, and um, he he sent he sent me a copy, made an upload, and I checked it out. And man, I got to tell you guys, I'm really blown away, man. The thing is clean. Uh, he doesn't have too many parameters. And when I asked him, "Can I share this with the rest of the gang?" he said, "No problem." So uh, I'm going to leave a link uh, to Ben's uh, YouTube page below. Show the guys some love, man, because this guy created something I think is, is probably one of the nicer, cleaner plugins uh, for stereo widening without phasing or any of that nonsense. I just want to go over some of the parameters with you to explain it. It's pretty easy. I don't have my screen capture software, so I'll walk you through this while I show you a picture on the screen. Let's check this out. So here's what Ben has. He's got a mix slider fader. He's got a width fader, and then he's got a left and a right button. That's it. And, and he's marked everything. It says uh, delay channel left or right. Basically, he's giving you the option to either delay the left channel or the right channel. Uh, either way works. And if you watch the video uh, that I posted a year ago uh, or so, you, you'll see that it, it really doesn't make a difference. It's preference. Uh, the mix is obviously the intensity of the effect that you want to hear when you have this plug-in on. And the width, and this is my favorite parameter, the width is basically uh, basically letting you know how far of a drag the left or the right channel uh, will have, how far of a drag, how far it'll be delayed. Um, and again, it, it, to get a really clear idea of, of what this thing is doing, just go check out that Stereo Widening Without VST Plugins video. Um, but this is it, gang. I'm going to leave an upload, or I should say a download, uh, as, as Ben said, it was okay. Uh, and again, show the guy some love, man, because uh, when you play around with this plugin, and I'm sorry that I can't uh, show you an example because, like I said, my computers are all in boxes. I played around with this on my laptop, and man, I was really blown away. The guy did a fantastic job. Uh, anyway, that's about it. Uh, download it, show Ben some love, play around with it. If you got some questions, uh, obviously feel free to ask. Uh, otherwise, man, have fun with it. Great little plugin. Uh, hopefully, I'll be seeing you guys around more often. Uh, when I get the studio set up. But uh, till then, peace out.